Action. Real like down here. Okay. All right, action. So this is the new off-grid knives Ridgeback, and this one is a special limited edition with this nicely contoured uh, gray and black micarta. You can see hints of blue in there. Really beautiful handle. Feels great in hand and uh, performs excellent. As you can see, excellently I should say. As you can see, this is uh, Scandi ground. That means that uh, bevel is the edge. So where the bevel begins, it goes straight down to the edge. Great for woodworking and great for uh, bushcraft. And here I'm gonna, this is a, a tree I'm gonna be using for a different video. All right, so let's see here. Let's go over here so the dog doesn't lose his mind, huh? All right, let's remove some of this bark here. See how this carves. Got this chest pull thing I've seen people do. I don't know if that's for me, but that is sharp. So this uh, black coating is a very slick coating so it goes through the material very easily uh, it's been going through this wood really nicely and carving really well so this was a nice chopping knife here when I just took this sapling down by the way this sapling was doomed due to its placement <laughs> she, my camera woman is giggling because I'm crying. oh you're crying I see <laughs> well let's see so this blade steel is 14C28N, uh, not something uh, not something we are unfamiliar with, but an excellent blade steel. Everyone loves 14C28N. Has some jimping up here, not too aggressive, just good for indexing, and has a um, flat back spine here for batoning and other kind of uh, woodcrafty stuff. Uh, I'm gonna do a tabletop uh, review of this knife and compare it to other fixed blade knives in its category and also to other off-grid knives so uh but for now this is the ridgeback limited edition in my car now all right you can cut you do it something cringy every time